Today on Vangaru Yukka. You seem a bit concerned. After three years, finally, my turn has come. It's my turn to attempt my biggest gap jump ever. Okay, you ready, Mondo? Ready, Mondo? See, somebody pooped on the landing. That's why I didn't do it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of big, and the casing pad is not really that great. Yeah. Here we are in Reading. <laughs> <laughs> Today we're gonna ride uh, Enticer. You may have heard of the trail Enticer Jump in Reading. It was three years ago the first time I came here, and I was simply a bystander watching Trevor having a good time jumping. <laughs> With my jaw dropped, thinking this was impossible. We came back here one year later, and that time it was Eric's turn to have a good time. Yeah! And of course, I was just a spectator, holding a camera towards Eric. I'm jealous of you! <laughs> and now, two years later, we've returned to Reading. Do you know what I'm thinking? Yeah, this day's more about you. Yes! Because I was here two years ago and I cleaned this trail. So today, I'm gonna be the one who having fun and Eric is gonna film me. Yeah, and I think it's gonna be easier for you than it was for me because I think you're a better jumper now than I was then. Plus, mm. plus you don't, you're not scared. You just send it, so. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, well, I have not humble. <laughs> I don't know, I have to see it's maybe bigger than in, in my head, you know? Yeah, the last one's probably going to be the most intimidating. Also, there's the two hipped ones, or the one hipped one, and then it's a really long one. I remember that being quite intimidating. Yeah, they, I don't like hips, so maybe that's a problem for sure. Yeah. I'm not greedy. I just want to clear those three scariest gap jumps on the trail. But uh, yeah, I'm ready. Ready to send it? Mm hmm Let's do it then. Sounds good. The strategy is the same as it was when Eric achieved to clear two years ago. Start with the safest jumps. And also, Eric already did lay out the zones, so I just need to follow his path. Ah. Oh, this one! It didn't take time to hit the wall. That's intimidating. And this too. Oh, it's dusty. Yeah, casing isn't bad. It's just look like a big gap in the middle. This one looks also gap, but uh, casing isn't bad neither. Now I know what I need to do. If the casing isn't bad, I just need to send it. Despite the dry condition, I could clear zone 1 after a few tries. However, zone 2 isn't as easy as zone 1. <sighs> nice! Zone 2 starts with a 20 foot gap jump, and it's a little hippy. And there's a 22 foot gap jump coming after. Those are my goal to hit by the end of the day. But for now, we skip zone 2 and move on to zone 3. So then, yeah, we got all these little gaps. Yeah, yeah I think this second one is the biggest and I cased it bad two years ago. Indeed, I did! Oh my god! It's kind of long, you know? It is, yeah. Yeah, from there, it looks so small that if you just come to the side, it's actually quite big. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Zone 3 started with a 24-foot jump, but I think I need to clear Zone 2 to get enough speed. And the next lily path is impossible for me to clear. Did you see that? There are not much depths left. Again! I cased it bad! 
Yeah, I kissed it, the second one. Did you? This second gap doesn't have a much dip neither. Any other voice? Pop. Pop? <laughs> yeah. I don't know how to pop. If you can't pop, go fast. <laughs> Speed is always my best friend. But maybe it wasn't enough. Mm. Little case? Mm, maybe a little. You got all the other ones though, so. Good? Good job, yeah. Is that good enough for you? For now, yes. Okay. Go down? <laughs> sure. Good. It's not perfect, but they're not my goal of the day. Zone 4 has three jumps close to each other, and the path is slim. Oh. It's so easy to miss the jump after. I missed it. I think the key is uh, that you must look ahead. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See, somebody pooped on the landing. That's why I didn't do it. Oh, yeah. Are you going to move it? Yes. Oh, it's uh, much more exciting to jump past the poop. That's true, but... Uh, so you have to film here, the landing, the poop. Sure. Okay. <laughs> okay, I really don't want to step on the poop, so I just go back up a bit more. Now things are getting more serious. Is it possible for me to avoid the poop? Or am I gonna land right on top of it? I didn't step on the poop, <laughs> did I? No, it's uh, you did a great job. You went way left of it. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. The poop drop has been defeated. Now we are going down to zone 5. And then you know what is waiting for me there. The scariest feature on the trail. 25 foot trail gap jump. Very nice. What do you think? Very nice. Oh, it's big here. Yeah. But there will be two sub bosses to defeat before the final boss. Before heading back up again, I need an energy charge. Oh yeah. Are you ready? I can send it. Great. Okay, we came back to the top. What do you think? We can do it? I think so, yeah. Okay, go for it. Yeah, you follow me? Yes. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. From now on, I will heavily rely on Eric's help. Eric completed the trail two years ago. He knows how to send the big features. Yeah, I think we have a plenty of uh, speed Need for so? this, yeah. Okay, just go up and do it. <laughs> yeah. The best way to defeat a scary feature is to mimic someone who can do it comfortably. I'm not looking ahead. Yeah, look ahead, honey. I need to look ahead. But it's not always the case. One more try. Look ahead. Oh, I can do it. My turn? Sure. It's time for me to try a bit. Okay, I think it's okay. There's always the first time, and they don't have to look pretty. Minimum line is to make it to the other side. That was close. Yeah, I just uh, jumped too far. <laughs> yeah. Survived. But you went right in the bushes. <laughs> yeah, maybe I didn't need to pedal. I tried to pedal like maybe two, three times yeah, after the hill. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do too. I thought I was going to be too short. <sighs> yeah, maybe not. Now I know how to send it. I just need to make a little adjustment. This time, I will not pedal. That was case. Now you have the opposite problem. Maybe one pedal? <laughs> when one problem is solved, a different problem comes out. Oh, 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 
Jeez. Did you see my moment? <laughs> yeah. I guess I should have just gone to the, the second gap. You're so sketchy. <sighs> yeah, because I wanted to avoid it. Yeah, but you can use the brakes, no? Yeah, I guess so. What the hell is your wife doing? Exactly. <laughs> I was thinking it used to be that, oh, Yuka did it. Yuka can do it, I can do it. But now I'm thinking, oh, Yuka did it and looks sketchy. <laughs> and now it doesn't give me confidence. It's like riding with Trevor. I'm making the videos hoping that you might gain some confidence watching me fail, challenge, and succeed in the progress. However, I've never known that my sketchiness may be the very reason messing Eric's head. How did I even do this last time? Before it causes more people to get nervous and less their self-confidence, I may have to stop this challenge right here right now <gasps> or I should just keep going okay next jump go for it coming the next jump is 22 foot gap jump Yeah. Good job. I was a bit intimidated because it was bigger. Yeah. Much better than taking this line <laughs> and crashing to the bush. Exactly. <laughs> After clearing those two jumps, I've got enough speed to clear the next jump. The first jump on zone three. However, the lily pad was impossible to clear. <laughs> and so was the second gap jump. Okay, one more. One more left. The biggest gap jump on the trail. And also, it's gonna be the biggest gap jump I've ever tried. Ah. Maybe I wanna start a bit higher. Yeah, I think it's way too close. Yeah. How to judge whether I've got enough speed for the feature it depends on how well I could do on the feature one before which is this jump However, there's a flat section coming and I really have to work hard to maintain the speed And by the time when I get to the main feature I'm not sure if I got enough speed What do you think the speed? I was looking through the phone, but it seemed like you're going just fine. Yeah? You seem a bit concerned. Yeah, it's kind of big and the casing pad is not really that great. Yeah. I've got nobody to follow. No one to show me the speed. And the casing the jump is not only breaking my bike, but most certainly also breaking my body. Many people just avoid a jump. Taking a risk feels stupid sometimes. But I saw Trevor hit the jump three years ago. And Eric hit it many times two years ago. Yeah. Question is always the same. Are you ready to send it? Okay. Overshot. My answer is always yes. Yeah, it's good though, isn't it? Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty easy. It's just a little nerve-wracking. Yeah, the looking is a bit, you know, intimidating. 
It's turned out to be as I declared. I'm gonna be the one who having fun and Eric is gonna feel me. But that's okay. Today was my turn to shine. Now I cleared the biggest gap jump ever. And if you cheered for me, give me thumbs up. Tell me what kind of challenge you like me to tackle next time in the comment. <laughs> this channel is supported by my patrons. May the year 2022 be lovely and full of smiles for you. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Wait, you did the biggest one, but you can't do these little hoppers? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, done. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye.